it's not just a timely show. It's not just for this day and age. It's timeless. What some call the greatest story ever told comes to life on the Sight and Sound stage. All of our previous shows have delved into a character who points to Jesus, and this show we get to spend two hours and ten minutes actually living with the person of Jesus. It could easily become a show about miracles and all the things that he did while he was on earth, but it's so not that. It's about relationship and the difference that a personal touch makes. The story of Jesus has been in the works for three years. It seems like a long time, but when you're sitting in it, it flies because there's sets being built, there's music being composed, there's script being written and then rewritten and then rewritten. Now in the last week of rehearsals, cast and crew members are working round the clock to polish the show. It's been very rewarding getting into the rehearsal process and then actually being able to start to take ownership of some of the stuff that we've been hearing a lot about, but now we Get to see it in action, which is cool. The opportunity of a lifetime to get to tell a story that is always going to be amazing to hear and to take in. And in order to tell it, we've pulled out all the stops. And the big addition to this show is a 110 foot long LED screen. It's the longest flying LED screen in the world. We actually raise it and lower it like a backdrop in a show. We actually fly it up and down. We move it. There's also a 110 foot wide rain curtain and computerized boats for the iconic walking on water scene. A lot of fun putting those story elements together and figuring out how we're going to make them work. And in one added element, members of the creative team traveled to Israel to make sure their set back here looks like the real setting. If an audience member couldn't be in Israel, could we create that moment here on our stage that could help them feel what that might feel like or look what that might look like? Aside from the set design and technical marvels, the cast and crew all agree the main purpose of the show is its message. Just understanding who he was as, as a man, you know, he was obviously fully God and fully man, but knowing him on a human level has been really inspiring in a lot of ways. Jesus opens here at Sight and Sound Theaters on March 10th, and all the shows for opening night are sold out, but you can see the show up until the end of the year. For Lancaster Online, I'm Irene Snyder.